there, Sarah Gallegos here with another little behind the scenes tip from Love of Quilting 2900 series. We want to talk to you a little bit about squaring up your fabrics and the best, most accurate ways to cut. Now, all of our rotary cutting mats, most of them anyway, have lines on them. And the temptation is to line up the straight edge of your fabric with a straight edge on the lines on the mat and then use the lines on the mat for cutting. And it's actually not nearly as accurate to cut using the lines on the mats as it is to cut using the lines on your ruler. And a couple of the reasons for that is when you are cutting into your rotary cutting mat, your blade is cutting right through that mat. And over time, you'll see that you get wear marks in the mat. And that tends to distort those lines and it can even make them wider than they were when they, they, when they first were painted onto the mat. Um, another tip for these guys too is that heat and cold are really difficult on rotary cutting mats. So if you've left yours in the car overnight, which I have done, they can tend to kind of bend with the heat and then you're definitely going to have distorted lines on your mat. So the very best way to have precise cuts, again, is to use the markings on your ruler. Now, I'm just gonna line up the edge of my ruler on one of the edges of my fabric and just do a cleanup cut to start. And a cleanup cut is just to give myself a nice straight edge. And of course, I probably should use my little glove. Safety first. So we're going to just do, again, just nice little cleanup cut here, just like that, okay? Get rid of the scrap. And now I know that I have a straight edge on my fabric to cut my strips from. So let's just say, for example, I needed a two and a half inch strip. Now I'm going to scoot my fabric over and I'm not worrying about keeping it straight with the lines on the mat because I'm not using them at all. I'm just going to make sure that I line up the two and a half inch marking on my ruler so that it's completely overlapping the raw edge of my fabric. Now we had a really great lesson from Toby Lishko about using the perfect precise quarter inch seams and then lining up the edges of your lines with the edge of your fabric for the most precise cuts. And then you can simply run your rotary cutter right along your ruler. And really important to make sure you have a nice firm hold on your ruler. You don't wanna push into or away from your ruler. It's just straight away from your body. And that's going to give you the very most precise cuts for your strips as you piece. Thank you. 